The report was compiled by the American Association of Retired Persons from statistics from the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services. Missouri has more nursing home deaths per 100 residents than the national average, more cases per 100 residents by the same measure, more staff shortages, and less personal protective equipment, PPE, in nursing homes than the national average. It is a small fraction of the U.S. population and yet continues to be 40 percent of the deaths. That's nationally. More than 3,400 of Missouri's dead are people over the age of 65. The head of the state's Nursing Home Association, Nikki Strong, says many facility residents have underlying conditions. So it's not surprising that we have in long-term care facilities a higher number of deaths than you'll see in the general population. And the state's positivity rate is about 20 percent, which is high. Kansas numbers are similar, except they are at the national average in PPE shortages. Still, I believe 20.3 percent of nursing homes in Kansas had less than one week of all protective equipment. Staffing nursing homes is a long term problem. Ever changing regulations and dealing with the virus on a daily basis for some has made it worse. I don't see how, uh, you know, the, the, the staff has hung on as long as they have because of, 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 of what they have to adhere to. As a report shows, both Kansas and Missouri nursing homes struggling with an unrelenting virus. Michael Mahoney, KMBC 9 News.